Welcome to Basketball Insiders on Sport Eagle TV. Our look at the young German talent continues. Patrick Heckmann of the Rosa Baskets Bamberg. Uh, Patrick, first of all, let's talk about this Bamberg team. So many stars, international stars. How does it feel to get any kind of playing time with these guys? <laughs> it's fun. I mean, no, it's, it's amazing. It's really amazing. It wasn't expected at all. Um, I thought I might get five minutes before the season, but you know, playing with them makes it a lot easier to find the to find rhythm, to find myself in Europe again, and yeah, it's really just a great time on the court. Now you, you spent some time in the lower uh, German leagues, and you went out to Boston College. How much did that help your game playing in uh, in American college basketball? Uh, I think I learned to play tougher against more athleticism. They played very physical, especially the ACC. They always have uh, tough teams to play really hard. Uh, I think that was the major key I learned in college to play uh, through ups and downs too. But yeah, mostly against playing athletic uh, opponents. Be honest, Cameron Indoor Stadium or uh, the Dean Dome, which is the toughest place? <laughs> Cameron probably. Uh, I mean, playing there is amazing. I know, 6,000 people, it's packed. But uh, in the Dean Dome, I mean, I don't know, 20,000 packed. It might not, might not be as loud as uh, at Duke, but it's both both places are really fun to play at. Did the crazies make fun of you at all? Were you a target of them? I don't know. I tried not to listen, but probably at some point, uh, probably someone, there was something about me. <laughs> so you came back to Germany. Bamberg picked you up. Uh, why Bamberg and why Germany? Why not anywhere else? Uh, I miss home. Uh, I wanted to start at home again. Uh, Bamberg is, is a great place, great coach. I think the best... Uh, basketball environment to develop my to develop my game uh, as I said play against really good players every day in practice then play EuroLeague I mean all that wasn't expected but uh, play EuroLeague at a high, really high level and just uh, yeah it was the right fit for me I think let's focus on the summer I know we're in the middle of the playoffs right now but uh, let's talk about the summer uh, the German team what's your status for that and um, how does it look for the German team at, at uh, qualifying for Eurobasket uh, I really haven't thought that far ahead, but uh, no, I've been I've been in contact with the federation, of course. Um, we'll see where it goes from here. I, I really don't know yet. I, if I get invited, I would like to play. Obviously, uh, it's really it's an honor to play for for your national team. And um, I don't know. I mean, the team the the goal is probably not probably definitely to win the group to qualify for the Euros. So yeah, I don't think there should be any any other goal in that. Um, give us a little insight. How, how important is it that you played American college basketball? You played for Bamberg, you played for EuroLeague. Does the Federation look at that? Did they look at your resume or did they look at potential? What have they said to you in that? Um, I think they're more focused on how I'm playing right now or how players are playing at the moment. Uh, I mean, there could be players playing uh, for you in the EuroLeague for 20, not 20 years, but for a long time and they couldn't be play, They could be playing bad right now. I don't know if they get invited, but I think it's more how you're playing right now at the time. That's what they're looking at. Patrick Heckmann of the Bamberg, I guess it's going to be the Broza Baskets, the Broza yeah. Baskets of Bamberg, and the German national team. Patrick, wish you the best of luck. And Bamberg going for uh, two titles in a row. Um, how does it look for you guys? Promising. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Okay, Patrick, thank you very much, and good luck the rest of the way. Thank you. Appreciate it.